yes, I Nina, I thought it was going to be nice <laughs> and now it looks like it's going to rain. What's going on? Well, I think the rain is going to linger on Saturday. I'm more hopeful for Sunday. The reason for the slight sort of change in the forecast is all due to our weather front that has been a little tricky to pin down. It's meant that after yesterday's brightness, it's been a case of cloudy skies today. It's moved its way eastwards as we've gone through the last 24 hours. The rain has really pepped up as we've gone through the second half of the day. But that weather front is going to then push westwards as we go through the weekend so that's why we're still expecting some rain through saturday but it should have disappeared on sunday high pressure building in so we're expecting some drier and brighter weather for the second half of the weekend but we have got some rain at the moment it will continue over the night some of that rain could be heavy at times temperatures will start tomorrow morning at around four to five degrees a rather damp start to things tomorrow morning. Grey skies and as we go through the afternoon, some of us will see an improvement. I think parts of East Kent more likely to pick up possibly some breaks in the clouds, something a little bit brighter as that rain moves its way further west into the afternoon. Temperatures a touch lower. It is feeling quite chilly this weekend. We've got highs of seven or eight degrees. But you can see how the rain starts to clear away. So overnight into Sunday morning, the cloud beginning to thin. So it does mean a chillier start on Sunday morning with temperatures just sitting above freezing at around two to three degrees. But overall on Sunday, it is the drier and the brighter day of our weekend. We'll see some sunshine breaking through into the afternoon, variable amounts of cloud, that chilly northeasterly breeze. So temperatures of seven to eight degrees. But the high that we saw will take us into the start of next week. So increasing amounts of sunshine as we head through Monday and Tuesday. But still the air quite cold. So daytime temperatures a little below average. And as we go through Tuesday and Wednesday, the increasing chance of perhaps some overnight frost. So it's not a complete washout this weekend, Ellie. Thank you very much, Nina.